everyone. I'm very honoured to be here to open the second Southern Tower Business Expo, the second one. This is only the beginning. Business forms the background of the economy and the success in our Shire. Our small business sector is particularly substantial and growing all the time. The Shire has over 52,000 registered and active Australian business numbers. Actually, I'm one of those too, because I'm actually a celebrant for some of the I haven't a real job. <laughs> So I'll be one of those as well. Probably I'll come here next year and maybe I'll tell you about someone's getting married. Or divorce. Or very. I do it all. My son said, I had to match and dispatch. Comes in handy, council. With around 43,000 of them located in our residential area representing home based businesses, which is pretty amazing. In fact, in the last 10 years, we have seen an increase in the Shire's residents working in the Shire. And uh, just uh, actually decrease the work I'm looking for in residents leaving the Shire for work. So, local jobs offer many benefits for residents, including the opportunity to better balance work, home life, and less time spent travelling on the road, leaving the beautiful Shire, which I'm sure you don't want to do. Southern Shire Council actively supports the business community through the Economic Development Unit by connecting and assisting Shire businesses, as these girls here behind me um, do a very good job. In the year 2000, Council adopted an economic development strategy, the key objectives of which were to work with small businesses and create substantial businesses to grow in local areas. Local jobs is very important. As part of the Council support, seven key business network is the IT, marine and boating, tourism, and of course you all know Jenny Lee involved in tourism, manufacturing, home-based business, allied health and complementary health, and the next gen Shire Jobs Network. So there's a lot happening in our beautiful Shire. These net networks enable businesses um, to business referrals and provide education and to support the local business. We also support tourism with our tourism manager, Jenny, as I mentioned before, who works directly with the industry to promote the Shire. We've done extremely well in that area. Not too hard to promote this beautiful place, is it? We also have a business accelerator. Everyone knows, I'm sure, about the shed which provides support and education to help small business flourish. And that, if you haven't been to the Shed, you should really go down there. It's quite an amazing location. The Shed has been operating now, operating now for the past nine years and has directly supported over 100 businesses and created more than 500 jobs. The Council Economic Development Team represent here today and also here to help with business, so talk to those girls. So please feel free to contact um, anyone through the Council, the Shed, or the tourism manager, and they'll certainly like to help you in every way they can. And as a major sponsor of today's expo, the Summer Shire Council was always very pleased to see so many of the Shire businesses showcased today. And I'm sure only being the second year, next year you might need a bigger location. I'm sure the trades will find it for you because they're a great sponsor. I congratulate the organisers of the expo, Natalie and Sydney Steele. Say your surname now. That's okay. <laughs> and uh, I believe that the shy is in good hands. We're going to go from street to street. So thank you for asking me here today. It's lovely to be able to open the second expo. So have a great day, everyone. You'll go away with a wealth of knowledge and have a really nice afternoon. Thanks. Thank I honestly haven't met a more savvy mayor, have you? <laughs> thank you so That's much. <laughs> thank you so much. We really do appreciate your support. If honestly it wasn't for council, we wouldn't even be in the Southern Shire area. So really appreciate your support. Thank you so much.